parents in Lowell are not happy. They say it took the high school hours to tell them about an emergency shelter in place. And because of a new cell phone ban that we told you about last week, most students couldn't reach out to their families. WBZ's Tammy Mutasa spoke to parents and their kids about their concerns. New tonight at 11. The lockdown emergency today comes just weeks after school leaders banned cell phones during class. And that's why there was some frustration from some parents who say they didn't hear about the lockdown for several hours. In those type of situations, you want to make sure your parents know you're okay. It was during English class this morning when Lowell sophomore Deborah Kaseke was ordered to shelter in place with the rest of her school for nearly two hours. School officials say a threat had been reported about guns at school. With her parents' permission, the 15-year-old shared her experience with us. I just hear that we're on a shelter lockdown. We didn't have our phones. Our phones is put in a lockbox, so we can't have access to it until the end of class. So Deborah couldn't call her parents. The shelter-in-place emergency happened a few weeks after school leaders banned cell phones in class, calling them a distraction to learning. I was worried. You know, I kind of wish I had my phone on me. There was something involved with a gun. The only reason parents like Lewis heard about the lockdown was because his son called during lunch when cell phone use is allowed. Other parents say they heard from school leaders hours later. It's scary, so that's one of the reasons why they need a phone because at least my kid was able to reach out to me and let me know what was going on before we got the actual text from the school. We have the library secure. While school officials say police didn't find any weapons and no one was in danger, some students say in the event of an emergency, maybe the lesson for school leaders is to reconsider. I think it definitely helps me in class when my phone's away. I'm definitely more focused, but I think in times like this, I think when like the shelter place is called, students should be allowed to have their phones right away. The Wathers see the benefit of not having the gadgets too. I feel like the message is fine. They just want kids to like focus better in school. I do want my phone on me, but as long as I'm in the school, I'm gonna follow the rules. And school leaders say they are working closely with police as they do their investigation into the incident. In Lowell, Tammy Matassa, WBZ News.